One of the main outcomes of the CoinForm project is a state-of-the-art system for automatically reviewing the credibility of tweets. It assigns a credibility label to tweets based on various credibility signals available online. This video introduces the CoinForm dashboard, which helps you discover trends of misinformation over a large number of tweets. The dashboard can be customized to your needs by defining the online sources where misinformation may appear. Sources are typically Twitter hashtags or keywords, but they can also be websites. In this particular case, we are mainly using hashtags coronavirus and COVID-19, as well as various news sites. Our system automatically collects the tweets and reviews their credibility, and you can visit the dashboard regularly to inspect the data. An analysis session typically starts by looking at the overview of collected and rated tweets, which also provides an overview of estimated credibilities. During the session, you may want to focus on a more specific set of tweets, which you can do by defining a variety of filters. For example, by default, we show you the last month of data. But instead, you can select the 14 million tweets from the last year, or focus only on those published last week. The timeline charts visually show trends in misinformation. The top graph shows all the tweets matching the current filters. The middle graph shows the misinforming, not credible tweets. And the bottom graph shows the credible tweets. You can also select only tweets which talk about specific topics of interest, for example, those mentioning AstraZeneca. In this case, we can see that on the 14th of March, there was a spike in misinforming tweets. You can further analyze this by adding a second filter to only see tweets talking about preventative medicine, for example. The dashboard also provides visualizations to help you identify topics associated with misinformation. Word clouds show the main words appearing in either misinforming or credible tweets. We can also restrict the word clouds to specific types of words, like those associated with medical conditions. If some words only appear for not credible tweets, this gives us clues about new misinformation trends. We can show similar information as a table, in this case, showing organizations mentioned in tweets and the estimated credibilities for those tweets. We see that AstraZeneca is mentioned in many non-credible tweets, while the CDC is mainly mentioned in credible tweets. Similar analysis can be performed using this graph. Finally, you can inspect individual tweets and get an explanation from our AI about why it has labeled a tweet as misinforming or not.